Hey, what is going on guys? It's Serge here, back doing the second episode of my Sanctum series. So, I hope you guys all enjoyed the first episode where I did the introduction to Sanctum 2, where I just went through and I showed you guys how to play and stuff like that. And now I'm going to be going on to the first actual level where you have to build the maze from scratch yourself and everything. So what I've just done is I've gone through and I've taken down my class a little bit. I've kept my good secondary on and I've just taken down all the towers to the lowest couple apart from um, one extra because there was like no actual lethal ones that I liked and just some of my perks which don't really do much apart from the instant respawn one so if I go sky autumn that's my main character so this is my class that's the primary weapon so it's a fully automatic assault rifle and the secondary fire is a grenade that explodes on impact which you guys saw last episode and then my secondary is a called ETK Tesla prototype which is just like an electric bul pulse that gets shot at them and it makes and that's actually really OP. Oh, and I've got to change all these back, so I'll put the cannon on. I'll put the lightning tower and I'll put the Gatling on, and then I'll just put this one on, which is rockets. It shoots homing rockets because if this one mine dispenser, na na na, and then that one's just the most OP. Um, tower in the game so I thought I wouldn't put that on so I'll put that on and then my perks are just a lightning bounce and then an instant respawn to try and speed it up a bit for you guys and then when you kill an enemy it explodes and takes a bit of damage off all the other ones so I thought I think that's pretty cool so let's get into it so we're playing on park and as you can see up in the mini map there it's not a very big map compared to some of the other ones which we'll get into so if we start by building the maze, we got six. So it does already have a couple of towers here, which is good. So then I've got two more. So I reckon, I think if. Yeah. So we do that, then that, so then I'll just go straight over there. And then we have my 250 points. So I'm just going to play, say, homing rocket about. No, actually, I'm going to place a cannon right there. And then upgrade it. And then we're ready. And I know I said last time that I don't really like the aim, but. It's alright, I guess. I was actually playing Loadout uh, just a minute ago with um, Classic, Calvin, one of my friends, and I was not going so good because I kept using Control to aim. So this is the Tesla. It looks like pretty good. Um, yeah, so that round was fairly easy. So now if we just lead them along here a little bit. So then next we'll build along here and they go around that tree then down there. But that's only if we need it. So now I'll place a Gatling just there and upgrade that and upgrade this. Then we're ready. Didn't even look oh we got so some got some screamers. And we got some walker pups. Yeah, as you could see there, as when I shoot them, it, um, stuff comes off them, and like goes onto the others. So it like took out a whole line of them. All right. So now, if we use these to go along here. Crap. Right, so now we'll put a homing rocket there and upgrade th 
this one a little bit more and then start upgrading this one then we'll go out and even look what we had again just some walkers not too difficult as you can see that gatling's taking out all the little midgets for me so that's pretty Right, so now we've got just runners, I think they are, and screamers again. So if you continue on the maze, she is. So now we've got a pretty good maze going on. So if we just, if we chuck a light, no, we'll chuck a homing down here and upgrade her. And get straight into it. Uh, this is a Walker Warrior. They're like, I think they might even be the Walker. Not a, well, they're not boss because they're not that strong, but they've got mo a lot more health and a much stronger attack than the other warriors. But as you can see, so once again, the weak spot for Walker Warriors is in the eye. Um, the weak spot for Screamers is in their bum, I think it is, to be honest. Yeah, so as you can see, they're a little bit harder to fight off. But nevertheless, they're not the hardest. Most definitely not the hardest. Oh yeah, and I forgot to introduce you to these guys. These guys are my friends. They're just helping me fight off all the monsters. But they've only got 50 health, so they don't last very long. <laughs> I wonder if um. no. So that's it. All the cores blocked off. Yep, so we finished our maze now. Now I think, yeah, this now we've got soakers. So now if we just upgrade. So now that's maxed out. That's got a couple points on it. So with soakers you've got to try and aim for their heads and the more you hit the heads the bigger they grow as you can see already. And they have a mother ton of health but they do not like hurt you so that's good I suppose see so they're pretty easy to take down these are probably my favourites because they're although they've got a lot of health which keeps you occupied and you just let all the other players when you're playing in a group take out the big bosses and stuff and you just say I've got the soakers and they're like yeah whatever and then it keeps you a lot laid back because <laughs> you're just following it, shooting it, you know. Yeah. Oh, so we got a bit. This is the final wave, so I can understand that there is a few. Let's see, place another one there. And I want to fully upgrade. Oh, upgrade that one. Then the rest of the points on him as well. Final wave. Yeah, you see how that Gatling and homing missile just... And then I'll leave the soaker for last. Take out the screamers and the walkers. Right, now let's take out this soaker that's making it around.
And then we go through, take out this one. Alright, so I think I'm just going to go through one at a time. So this has just been a pretty quick ranked up. So this has been a pretty, pretty quick second episode of my Sanctum series, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And just unlocked an SMG. Yeah, so once again, I actually did a bit more damage than the towers this time. Got more kills, everything else. So... I hope you guys all enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, you know, whatever. And, yeah, I'll see you guys all next time when we move on to Biolab, I think it is. Alright, guys, see ya.